Hey there guys, it's Delta49 here with a tutorial on how to install the GLSL shaders mod with Optifine for Minecraft 1.7.2. Now the first thing you want to do is go into your Minecraft launcher, and once that loads up, click edit profile using any profile, and under used version select release 1.7.2 and click save profile. Now click play, and this will download a new version of Minecraft 1.7.2 for Forge to work with. Now once you get to the menu, click quick game and go into your web browser and go to the files.minecraftforge.net page which is linked in the description and find the 1.7.2 latest download and click the installer. Now this will bring you to an ad fly page and wait the 5 seconds for the skip ad button to appear in the top right and click skip ad. Now save that on your desktop and go ahead and go over to the shaders mod thread which is also linked in the description and find the for Minecraft 1.7.2 section and click the link to download it and this will bring you to a specific entry on the thread and once it loads up you can see that there's some information here and then click the download link to download it and wait for the ad fly page again and once the skip ad button appears in the top right click skip ad and then click download on the Dropbox page now save it on your desktop as well and then go to the Optifine downloads page which is also linked in the description and find the newest version for Minecraft 1.7.2 and click download and this will again bring you to an ad fly page and wait the five seconds and then click skip ad in the top right. Then in the middle of these ads here you want to click the download Optifine link and then save that on your desktop. Now go ahead and go to your desktop and then double click the Forge installer. Make sure the install client radio button is selected and click OK and click OK again. Now go into your Minecraft launcher and under the profile selection select Forge and click play to reauthenticate and then click the big play button and this will load up Minecraft with Forge. Now once it gets to the menu you should see in the bottom left that Minecraft Forge is installed and then you can click quick game. Now on your keyboard press the Windows key and the R key and type percent A P P D A T A percent and click OK. Now go to your .minecraft folder, your mods folder and then drag the shaders mod jar into the mods folder as well as the optifine jar into the mods folder. Now you can close that window and go back into Minecraft and make sure that the shaders mod is working. Make sure the Forge profile is selected and then it says ready to play Minecraft 1.7.2 Forge and then click play. And then once the window comes up you should see that there is an extra mod loaded which will be the Optifine mod. You can also see it in the bottom left and if you go to mods you can see Optifine shows up. Now the shaders mod for some reason does not show up in the menu, but it does not mean that it's not working. So if you go ahead and go into a world, and then go into your menu, go to options and shaders, you can see that the shaders mod is working. But you will need a shaders pack to actually see the difference. So now what we're going to do is we're going to quit the game, and then go into our web browser again, and go to the shader pack page that you would like. For this tutorial I will be using Sonic Ethers Unbelievable Shaders and that is linked in the description along with a bunch of other shader packs that you can use. And you want to scroll down and just find the download link. And you can see right here it says the latest and you want to download the latest version and it will bring you to an adfly page or some other download page and just wait for the skip ad button to appear and click skip add and then you'll have to check this box and then click download and save it on your desktop. Now once you get to your desktop you can see that it's right here and you want to again press the Windows key and the R key on your keyboard and type percent A P P D A T A percent and click OK. Now go into your dot Minecraft folder, your shader packs folder and drag the zip folder into the shader packs folder. Now go ahead and go into Minecraft 
Make sure the Forge profile is selected and click play. And then once it opens, you should see that in the options menu, if you go to shaders, you now have a new option. So you can double click that and click done, done, and we'll go into a world and test it out. And as you can see, the shaders mod is working and it looks very nice. All the shaders are functioning correctly. Now that is the end of the tutorial, but if you did find this helpful, a like and a favor would be greatly appreciated. If you do have any questions, you can leave those in the comments below. And of course, a like, a favor, and a share would be greatly appreciated. If you're not already, make sure you follow me on Twitter, like the Facebook fan page, and follow me on Google+. All of the links are down in the description below. And if you did enjoy this and you want to see more daily gaming tutorials and reviews, make sure you subscribe. Thanks for watching.